Okay, we're just going to talk. No need to introduce you. Now, when I spoke to you guys a few weeks ago, you said you weren't even sure if you guys would have time to come on So You Think You Can Dance. We did not know if we would have time. Yeah, and you made it happen with a child, with other jobs. How? How did you... You always make time for So You Think You Can Dance. It's, you know, it's it's the show that helped us in our careers. It helped us, um, you know, be where we are. We just won an Emmy. We're so grateful, you know. Uh, we always have to try to find time. But thankfully, you know, things do come up because of our exposure on this show. So our schedule's been kind of busy. And we haven't, we've been more fans at home watching, you know, this season. It's been really enjoyable to, to really watch all the contestants and watch their journey. I've really had a good time doing yeah. that. Yeah. Not as stressful. You yeah, get to be I'm home sure. and you're like, whoa. And you become Where? a ju instant judge all of yeah, a sudden. Yeah. You know, when you're here week in and week out and you, you see the numbers and you feel for the other choreographers and for the contestants. So you, you look at them, I think, differently. As soon as you're at home, you're like, man, they could have did this and they should have yeah. did that. And so you don't, you don't see the weekly journey. You yeah. just see the overall journey throughout the entire season. And it's really, really fun to see. What contestants were your favorite this season? Well, yeah, I mean, we, we I loved Zach's journey for sure. We got to work with Jessica, um, and she's like quiet, like she's a quiet spirit, and she just is like, okay, got it, you know. And, and I really appreciate that. We made a lot of last minute changes to just refine what we needed to do, and she handled them like a champ. But then, of course, getting in the room with Emilio, who does what we do, was like, Rah! that was just awesome. So. You know, we didn't get the chance to really like work with a lot of the other contestants. So uh, yeah, I mean, those are the ones that stood out to us. I think, I think for me, the the journey of Zach really is what got me. It gets, yeah. it, gets it, you know, it it, uh, it gets to your heart a little bit. So he becomes your emotional favorite. Yeah. Yeah. I agree. Now I had the pleasure of working with you guys recently, and I have to tell you, when I got <laughs> when I got the email about the video and I saw that you two were directing, it was a pleasant surprise. So is that what you guys are segueing into now? Absolutely. We would love to continue to direct more. We've been, this past year, and a couple years, you know, we've been doing more creative directing for, we were creative directors for American Idol, and and we do all that stuff for Jennifer Lopez, and, you know, but, but everybody now knows us as choreographers, so they're like, yeah, creative direct, and then choreograph. You know, but what we're trying to transition a little bit more, you know, is as we move on just with progression of life. It's like we see things differently. I mean, he loves getting behind the camera and he just, you know, he I think you're just as excited about that now as the dance steps. It's like, how do I want to see it? What do we, how are we going to shoot it? So it's been fun. Fine. I, I think um, being behind the camera has been a, a, a for me a, a real it's been something I've been passionate about, but not just the single camera. It was originally the multi-camera directing. Okay. But I have a newfound love for single camera directing, which so which brought hard. on the yeah, which it brought on the uh, the the music video, and we've directed uh, four, five, five now music videos. So it's uh, it is transitioning, and we're having a great time doing it. That's for sure. Awesome, awesome. Now, little birdie told me about the movie that you guys are working on. Can you talk to our viewers about it? It's, it's going to be an amazing movie, and uh, it's Beach Boys music. It's uh, called All Summer Long, but sadly, we were supposed to be starting this past week, um, and it got pushed. So we may, yeah, yeah which is normal, so it, I'm not sure when it'll be coming out, and we had an amazing audition. We had so many people from the dance community come out, and, and we're super excited, and hopefully it'll come back in the um, spring. It'll definitely come back in the spring. It just it had it ran in a few little snags that the producers didn't want to... Uh, to uh, compromise on and, and deservedly so. It's going to be an amazing film. Big movie musical. Yeah. Not just involving the Beach Boys music. Big movie musical. And uh, Craig Zayden, Neil Marin are the, are the producers and uh, as you know they've produced um, Chicago and Hairspray and, and a whole bunch. They had 17 when we got our Emmy nom nomination they walked in and said oh you guys congratulations on your nominations. I said oh yeah congrats on yours. And then one of the other guys in the room goes, well, which one? And they were nominated for 17. Oh. So I, it's a... Just to be in that company yeah. is like, oh. Yeah. I mean, yeah. They, they do everything. All the, all the big uh, award shows, they do the Oscars. I, I'm so excited to start on this film. Nice. That I, I can't stop blabbing about it. Oh, awesome. <laughs> you guys have been incredibly blessed. You have a beautiful family. Everyone in the industry adores you. Can you tell me, what is your dream job? You've tackled some pretty awesome things, but when you two are at home at night, you have that dream job that you talk about. What would it be? I have the dream job. Our dream job is 
uh, interestingly enough, a couple years back, Atlas Entertainment hit us up and said, we think you'd be awesome directors. Do you have any films in mind? And right away, just like that, right away, we, we went out and pitched them on a few things. They loved them both. And both of those films are floating around. Our, our, my big dream job is directing one of these films that I'm really passionate about. We'll say a prayer. Yep. There. Same thing. For you. Yes, same thing. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I think everything that is, we started our career together. It's like our dreams are the same, our passions are the same. You know, I have a different skill set than he does. Once we get into the, you know, into the location and into the process, but it's, but it's this, yeah, but it's still the, you know, it's the same overall uh, journey that we're aspiring to do together. I have another one. <laughs> another. So um, we've directed a couple s stage shows, of course, but. But uh, recently, um, Derek Huff and Julianne Huff, good friends of ours, their tour, they went on tour. It was predominantly a dancing show. Then we also put up the Jabberwocky show, which is, runs in Vegas for the next six years. Um, our Another dream job is to have that big dance um, show that tours around with no singing, just dancing, and that people will come and watch that. Uh, you know, obviously, that's, it, it, it's not far away. And we, and we have a passion for a different style of stage show. So not just that regular come and sit down stage sh theater show. This is a very interactive show. And we we recently played um, with uh, in LA here with a couple of different shows and went over really well. Great reviews on the shows. And this interactive thing is something that is going to blow the minds of everybody in the country and a whole new way to look at dance. You just inspire me. I don't. I don't know how you do it. We talk a lot. Now. I can't. Uh, uh, and, yeah. And how long have you two been married? Uh, oh, we've been you, married for 16 years and together for 21 years. See, he he knows all this stuff. I'm the one that's supposed to know all this. Stuff. I know. I was actually thinking that. I was like, he's on it. I want to be like you when I grow up. Any kind of thing about dates, numbers. 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 Oh. Finances. You've had a key for That's here. me. But <laughs> if you ask me to come up with the newest, coolest groove, that will not be me. That'll be her. And I've witnessed it. So true. <laughs> so true. Look at you in the dress, working it. <laughs>